The defense force plane carrying the remains touched down in the afternoon. The occasion was marked with ululating, <laughs> traditional dances and revolutionary songs, as well as a Herero regiment. Also at the airstrip to receive the remains were traditional healers, councillors, members of parliament and high-ranking government officials. The coffin was carried by a detachment of the Namibian Defence Force from where it was immediately driven to her village of Okasheshe for traditional rituals and for family members, friends and mourners to pay their respects. A second memorial service will be held at Opuo Stadium on Friday and the day after she will be buried at Okodo Konjoda Cemetery in Kunene region. We spoke to some of the people at Opuo and this is how they remember Muharukwa. She was a helpful woman to most people at her village and the region in general. She was a shoulder to cry on and she will not allow anyone to go to bed hungry unless she was not informed. She had education at heart and has always been encouraging us to send our children to school. 